Hi, I'm Joseph from Planet IT. Today, we're gonna to talk to you about setting up two-factor authentication, or 2FA as we call it. So let's jump onto both my laptop and my phone, and we'll take a look. Right, so we head over to our laptop. What we're gonna to wanna to do is go onto your chosen web browser and go to microsoft365.com. And then once we're there, if we can get logged in with your normal work email address, then you hopefully you'll be greeted with your normal page. Once you're there, if we can pop over to the top right-hand corner, but there'll probably be your initials or a picture of yourself and click on to view account. And once that pops up, you'll be greeted with a couple of tiles. The one we're gonna to wanna to click is security info. So we can click onto that and then update info. Great, and while we're here, we're gonna be greeted with a couple of options that are probably already filled in, but what we're gonna to wanna to do is click add sign in method and then you're gonna be great to choose a method. We're gonna to wanna to click Authenticator app, and then click Next and Next. Now what we're gonna to wanna to do is move over to our phone and go to your chosen app store. So that's App Store for iPhone or the Play Store if you've got an Android. And then we're gonna to wanna to type in Microsoft Authenticator app and download the top one, which should be a blue padlock with a little person inside. So now if we let, down, let that download on there, hopefully you'll have a QR code on your screen now. So that's absolutely perfect, you're in the right steps. So if you can open up the app on your phone and accept the couple of prompts that come through there. And then on there, you're gonna to wanna to choose scan a QR code. Now you might be asked to give permissions for the use the camera for that app. That's absolutely fine, it's just for this method. And then what you're gonna do is point your camera right at the QR code and accept any messages that come up there and hopefully that should fill on the app, put your details in there. So once that's done, you can put that back down and click next back on your laptop screen. And now what that's gonna do is gonna give you a code. So in this case it's 40, so I'm gonna pop 40 in on the prompt that's just come up on my phone and accept that. That is done. Then just next on the screen and that should be absolutely done. If you get any issues, feel free to give the help desk a call and we're more than happy to help. Otherwise, we should be done. Thanks for watching.